everyone, it's Pixel8 here, and welcome back to another Sims 4 news and info video. There was a patch today. We have a brand new free patch update, and today I'm going to give you a full overview of the patch notes, just like I do with every single free patch update. If you're not already subscribed, make sure you click that subscribe button, turn on notifications so that you can be one of the first people to be notified for any type of Sims news. But to jump into things, this is update for September 3rd, 2020. PC version 1.6613910.20 and Mac version 1.6613912.20 Console version 1.31 Hello Simmers, we are super excited for the upcoming release of The Sims 4 Star Wars Journey to Bat 2 so today we have an important update for you to address a couple of critical issues as well as a few updates to some existing features. Have your Sims ever dreamed of a jungle themed wedding escape? I'm not even going to try to pronounce that word. Or or a quiet yet elegant wedding in the woods. Sims can now elope in any of the destination worlds. Picture this, a warm sunny day in Selva Dorada, your Sim and their loved one accompanied by the bustling sounds of Puerto La Mante. It is like the best premise for one of Rusty's telenovelas. Besides letting, I mean encouraging Sims to elope to destination worlds, we have made windows a little more dynamic if you will. You can now place windows by stacking them above each other without the use of BB move objects cheat. This may seem small, but we hope builders enjoy the addition. So my video was right. Yay. The speculation was right, guys. This is exciting. For PlayStation 4 players, we checked around and we found some additional memory. This should help those simmers who were unfortunate enough to crash during travel and transitioning in and out of built by on some of their more built up saves. Last but not least, we have also made a change for PC and Mac in which there will be a new folder auto generated and documents electronic arts. The Sims 4 called config override inside this folder players can place a copy of default.ini graphicscard.sgr and or graphicsrules.sgr which will override these files where the game is located so if you edited these files before you can now edit them in the new folder okay i like that happy simming sim guru romeo featuring sim guru rusky now on to the fixes the sims 4 base game mouse hovering over purchase traits will no longer display the text not available for robots. We understand that robots are sentient beings, but unfortunately these traits are not robot compliant. Fix an issue in which lots with applied terrain manipulation were being placed backwards when downloaded from the gallery. Where's the door? Is this the front or the back? Order has been restored at last. Fix an issue in which terrain paint did not apply correctly under trees or foundations. The user interface team did some housekeeping and have fixed some background stretching happening in the career panels. Blinking shadows no longer appear when placing windows in basement levels that are of the same variant. I do admit that was a bit spooky, not the time windows, not the time. Color swatches for build mode item large dancing water emitter have been fixed. Staircases will no longer get cut through trims when there is no landing. Safety first. Discover University. Some flowers and trees in Gibbs Hill will no longer appear to be floating as Sims walk by. To be honest, the idea of floating flora is quite appealing to me. Eco lifestyle. Civil designer Sims will no longer come home after work wearing random footwear. I'm all for putting your feet up after work, but switching footwear in the middle of things and coming home from work in a completely different state as you went out is kind of suspicious. Fix an issue that caused some color swatch glitches on civil designer outfits. Realm of Magic. Fix an issue with thumbnails generated in the gallery for toddlers that generated not only their sim form, but also included their spellcaster form. We can only contain the cuteness so much. And last but not least, nifty knitting. What's that? Did you still hear the sounds of knitting when canceling knitting interactions? Not a problem anymore. Fix an issue with asset CF hair underscore SP17 locks long that made it display all adult color swatches. Wow, how did I read that so fast without messing that up? I'm honestly surprised. So that's going to be it. It's a little mini patch update, I guess you could say. Make sure you guys remove your custom content and mods from your mods folder before you update and then afterwards check to see if those mods and custom content need updating before you put them back in. I don't want you guys messing up your game, but I hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you find it entertaining and informative. Be sure to give it a huge thumbs up, subscribe, ring the bell, and leave a comment down below. Also, don't forget to follow me on social media. Links are down in the description box below. I love each and every one of you guys to the moon and back, and I will see you all next time. So long and happy simming.